Hi, I'm Mitchell Spearman. It was very exciting to watch Russell Henley win his first tournament, the Sony Open in Hawaii. What I really liked about watching Russell was how freely he swung the club. It was an uninhibited free motion. And the shot that really stuck out to me was his shot on 12. He hit his tee shot left of the fairway onto the cart path, took a drop, was in the rough, had about 140, 150 yard shot, had to control the trajectory of the shot and get a draw. So how did he do that? In my eyes, what he was able to do in that swing there was you could see in the practice swing, he really worked really hard on getting his hands low down here through the ball. He made several practice swings trying to get his hands low down here through the ball. And then when he swung through, it was in a very abbreviated finish. He stopped his arms very quickly on the follow through. And if you do that, you actually get quite a lot of power, even though you haven't got a full swing because the club head really whips through the ball. And so he was able to control the trajectory, just caught a, a very uh, slight catch on the limb there, but still went up pin high right off the side of the green. So that was a really great shot. He was able to stay over the ball and just get his arms down early on that shot and swing the club head through with a short follow through. Then watching him throughout the rest of the round, what I really liked about, with obviously all the tension there for him to win his first tournament, was how free it was. And the thing that I think we can learn from Russell Swing is when he takes the club away from the ball here, is that on his takeaway here, he lifts the club up like this. It's almost an old fashioned drag away. The grip of the club moves first, the head of the club moves second. So it's a drag here. His takeaway is quite narrow. He gets to a nice wide top of the backswing as a result. And then the follow through is massive unwind through the ball. But the first key is dragging the club off the ball. So you almost want to feel like you're leaving the club head behind and you're starting the club with the, the swing with the grip of the club head. Start with the grip leave the head of the club behind. It's like you're pulling the shaft out of the head. Go back this way and do that. That's a way to be able to get more power and more distance and swing in a free, uninhabited motion like Russell Henley did to win his first tournament.